do. This is very amazing. We love you! Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. It's amazing because, believe it or not, I still think of myself as a country doctor that has gone to Congress, and I'm a quiet little congressman from Texas. Yeah. rather quiet, but for some reason, uh, in the past 18 months, it was discovered that the ideas of liberty and the revolution was alive and well, and we're celebrating it here tonight. I wish they had all the speakers that spoke today. I really do want to thank you. The support that you have given to me personally, to my family, and to the campaign has been really, really helpful to all that I've done. But you, but you know, uh, Barry Goldwater uh, gave me a wonderful introduction. He uh, talked about my family. But you know, he mentioned my, my wife Carol's been sick and she's home and doing much better. But, uh, doing a lot better because before I left home she gave me a lot of instructions <laughs> and she told me what I was supposed to say here tonight and one thing that she wanted me to say was a thank you was personally from her for the support the prayers and the uh, letters and comments that you have made we have really been blessed with all of your friendship saw something very wonderful about it because our Christian friends sent you sent us good wishes and prayers and our Jewish friends sent good wishes and prayers and our Muslim friends sent us good wishes and prayers and lo and behold we received a lot of good wishes from some agnostics some atheists and we were delighted to get those as well Conviction that freedom brings people together. You know, early on in the campaign, I thought I might have really messed up because, uh, you know, I answered a question rather truthfully about me becoming president. And uh, I, I have truly been a reluctant candidate and uh, was not all that anxious to do it, not thinking that there would be a large number of people who cared. I was skeptical. Some said that uh, you were apathetic and we helped remove that, but I lost my skepticism. I hope you lost your apathy. Yeah! Let us be responsible. 
respectful. But I also understand that we do not have to respect the condition that allowed both other conventions to get $16.8 million apiece to run their party. This was not inexpensive, and all of you contributed to it, and some a lot more than others. A lot of volunteers, a lot of money, and we pay every cent, and there is going to be no debt. about what we do. It would be nice to be relaxed and uh, think that we're back in the 1950s when I first barely started thinking about politics, but it's not the 1950s anymore. It's a new, it's a new uh, century and there's a lot more problems. And we have terrible threats around the world. We have a 